Hello and welcome to the first ever episode of I Will Cast Anything. We have a TVP for you on Callisto. In the bottom left hand corner, the Terran player is The Situation. He's a good friend of mine. He sent me this replay. Uh, he is a diamond, he tells me he's top, near top at least, of diamond Terran player in the Europe. And over here we have Callisto, who is a Masters level Protoss player. This game was played a couple of days ago, I believe. Now the situation, as I said, is my buddy, so we're probably going to be paying mostly attention to him. Also, I should mention that I don't know what I'm doing. Supply depot going down. Pylon going down. Nothing too surprising here. Uh, the situation has told me that he likes to play aggressive, so we'll have to see if he goes for the one racks expand that you would expect to see from a Terran against Protoss, or if he will be a bit more unconventional, shall we say. We do see the barracks going down first, and the gateway for Protoss, and the probes heading out to scouts. So it's the gateway probe scouting. And now the SCV scout comes out. Oh, and he's going to put down a supply depot. No, he's not. Oh, but the Protoss has missed here on his scout. Gone down into the natural there. Not heading up the ramp. It's a bit strange. He's not really seen anything with that scout. Maybe he just wanted to know where the other player was. Player spawning in bottom positions here. Close by air. Situations SCV comes up now. Sees everything. Sees the cyber core going down. Doesn't see... Oh no, he is going over now to see the gas. It's been taken already. And he also has taken the gas and is taking his second as we speak. Reactor core going down on the barracks. No units out yet though. Second gas going down for the situation. I mean for Callisto. Messing up already. Still probes. Still scouting out here. And a little scuffle. But Callisto has no scouting information and what the situation is doing. Whereas the situation knows all about Callisto's plans. Another gateway going down. Factory going down. I think we could be seeing some early signs of aggression from the situation here. He's not going for that expansion. He's throwing down a bunker by his ramp. I think we're going to see some sort of early pressure at least. Got a couple of marines out here. Got a stalker out on the map. More stalkers coming. And a starport in production for the situation. We are definitely going to see some aggression here. But Callisto, you know, he's doing well. Got a small probe lead, but nothing significant at the moment. Got a couple gateways down. Throwing down another one. And the stalker has been denied entry to the base here, so it looks like Callisto still doesn't really know what's going on here, and that could be important. He probably doesn't know that this early pressure is going to be coming, but the question is when is it going to be coming? We've got a tank out. Mules coming down now. Orbital Command is up and running. The Starport is up and we see the Banshee coming. Well, maybe this won't be early pressure. Maybe this will just be a bit of harass. Ooh, Proxy Pylon going down now. So he doesn't know what's in the base. Maybe that's got him worried. Maybe Callisto thinks, I have to push back now. I can't wait. 
warp gates are up now, so he can start bouncing units over to this pylon, but what's he going to bring in? Blink researching, he's going to be going stalkers, I think. Yes, here we go, more stalkers warping in. That Banshee is going to struggle against those stalkers, and there aren't many marines here, but this tank, well, if they're going to be blinking about, could be trouble for the tanks as well. But the situation has a good wall up here. He has a barracks, a bunker, barracks. There's a barracks in the wall, but that's a bunker. Robotics facility coming now for Callisto. And he's just content to sit out here. And the situation seems content to sit in his base. No expansions yet from either player. And it looks like that harass was beaten off there. Oh, and we're seeing the situation pushing out now. He's taking out this pylon. He's not waiting anymore. He's got his Banshee out. Needs to take down the sentry. If he can. And he does take down the sentry, but the stalkers are blinking black, blinking, blinking back. There's lots of stalkers up here. This is going to be tough to push on into the base here. I think the situation is going to have to set up camp outside. Not really much tech coming down yet. Haven't seen any upgrades going down. Got an observer coming out from the robotics facility. And just lots and lots of stalkers. But more tanks coming up now, they've contained is in full effect from the situation here. Oh, big engagement! The stalkers holding at the top of the ramp, they're not blinking down, in fact they blink away! Situation, oh! Yes, he's pushing into the base now. Oh, but they blink forward, they take out those marines, he's being too conservative with his tanks here, he needs to push up to the base of this ramp. And I think the Protoss player is feeling a little bit unsure of what to do here. He's just waiting now. More pylons, more stalkers coming in, but not much going down from the Protoss player. Whereas the situation is bringing in more Banshees. He's got a command center coming down. He's expanding now, but he's keeping his opponent contained here. Just prodding up at the front. Oh, we have a pylon going down in the middle of the map here. Callisto might try some sort of counter-attack to try and break this contain. Yes, he's sending two zealots. And this supply depot is down. The wall is down, so those zealots could get into the ba base and wreak havoc on the situation's economy. He is supply blocked here. Which is odd. And we do have two zealots into the base. SEVs going down. Oh, he does pull the SEVs there, and still just sitting out here, nothing much going on. Two Marines out now. Zealots are going to chew through those, so there's still going to be a problem, and he needs to... the situation even, sorry. He is my buddy, I do know his name. He needs to deal with this. He's, his workers are being run around in circles here. Meanwhile, huge Blink Stalker army sitting out here. You see another orbital command coming down, so he does need to get up and working with his economy. And he's proving his SEVs down. Has he finally? Yes, he has finally got rid of those zealots. But another one's coming in. Oh, and it looks like the push out has come from Callisto, and the situation is just, just backing off, just going home. Just waiting. Still no upgrades coming down. For either player. Immortals coming out. Blinking forwards. Oh, he's going to take out some of these marines here. But he's just afraid to engage these banshees. And now these siege tanks up on the high ground. Going to have problems pushing up here. That zealot is just hanging around in there. It's lost a lot of economy, it seems. What are the unit counts looking like? Yes, 24 probes, 18 SCVs. Not great. 19 stalkers out on the map, 3 siege tanks, 5 banshees, well, 
see the Banshee's coming in for some pressure here. Is there anything left home to deal with this? It doesn't look like it. That harass could be pretty effective. This pylon is still up here for reinforcements to come in for Callisto, but he's just hanging around. And again, he's not really producing much. He's got quite a bit of money. He's not really doing anything with it. But now the push comes. He's pushing up the ramp. He takes out a siege tank. The Marines are falling. Another tank is coming in. And the Banshees, it looks like, are being very effective here. He's having to blink back Micro, but he is going to be pushed back. And the situation is going to repel this attack. Now will he push on? And that's the GG, that's it.